Hey guys, we're gonna make some guac. You guys wanna learn how to make guac? We're gonna do a little quick tutorial. And with me today, my lovely assistant, actually she's gonna be doing all the work, Lou. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. And she's got a knife. Don't mess with her, she'll cut your face. So we are making guacamole. We call it guac in our household. And what you will need is the following folks. Red onion, purple onion, a lime, two avocados that are soft, but not too soft. And then um, like a small tomato, but we just have a collection of mini ones because that'll work too. And some hot chili peppers. We've got hot chilies, baby. And we're eating it for dinner, so we like to serve it with chips, cheese, and chicken. Chippies. Oh, it's so good when you melt that mm. shiznat all together. <laughs> it's delicious. It's a warm, delicious mess. It's like under five bucks, probably. But yeah, if you buy guac in the store, it's like four or five bucks, you know? And this makes a big little bucket. Wow. <laughs> Let's begin. Show us what you're doing here, honey. I am cutting the avocados. There is a pit. <laughs> what do you call this, a pit or a nut or whatever? Let's say nut, because it's more fun to say. There's a nut in there, folks. And then you just scoop out the meat. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Let's, let's Sorry, did I show... Do that too fast. Yeah, we'll show on the next one, I guess. <laughs> Get out of there. Scooping at me. Avocados are so good. I've heard mm -hmm. you can make a pretty mean matcha smoothie with avocados and a banana. Apparently, it really? tastes like heaven. It's so green. I love it. So the funny. thing that I like about healthy food is often it's very colorful. You know, like, look at all these great shades of gray. Chili! Whoa, big nut! Oh, you look so beautiful. Uh, whatever. Espresso yourself. All right, so you scoop out the avocados. Then... Juice of a lime, my friends. What'd you just do there? To this. Yeah? You use a whole It one. looks like you know what you're doing, so you may as well keep doing it, right? <laughs> I'm gonna squeeze that. <laughs> Go wash your hands. This one's amazing. Sorry. Oh, look at that lime. It's so green and beautiful. <laughs> yeah, normally I think I just because we're only using two avocados, so I probably only use Half a lime with two avocados. Got it. I'm gonna use more. Okay. Let's make this limey. And then you just stir it up. And just throw some chilies in there. Whoa! Whoa. Balls! <laughs> That's gonna be spicy! <laughs> spicy. Now we cut the onion. Would you cut the whole onion? Because it's a smaller one? I'm probably gonna do the whole onion. Purple onion is fantastic, especially in the guac. It's like really brings up the flavor, but you taste it. The next morning, oh, yeah. you wake up and it's like, oh. <laughs> so brush your teeth a few times after you eat this. <laughs> Especially if you're sleeping with someone. <laughs> love, honey. So we'll scoop what we got in there. Boom. Boom. And let's just. And stir it up. Oh yeah, look at that green that guac. It's so bright and colorful. Yeah. One thing you should know about guac is it doesn't keep well outside in the sun in a plastic container. It'll turn brown and look like someone barfed in a Tupperware. <laughs> Aww. And you will throw up. <laughs> That's not us for the record. Those were friends. No, it was kind of our fault. Now we're on to the tomatoes. Cutting our little cherry tomatoes. Mm -hmm. The other option is you can also put this stuff in a blender if you don't want it as chunky. That's true. Like a couple times we've taken um, blended up, taken the onion and the 
uh, tomato. If it's like a, if it's a big tomato rather than cherry tomatoes, then sometimes we'll just toss it in a blender and just blend it quickly, and that makes it less chunky. But yeah. we we kind of like the chunky guac. It depends what you like. It's, yeah, it's totally our preference. All right, folks, chips are done. Tomatoes are done. Mm -hmm. There we go. Oh, that looks good. That looks real good. <laughs> Stir that up. <laughs> so demanding. Bees in. Thank you. Yeah, you tell me. Okay. Is it the best thing you've ever tasted? Mm. Can I have one? The lime? Really good. Now we're going to have dinner. Eat our guac and watch Seinfeld. Yay! Because that's awesome. what we do. Thanks for watching, guys. But let us know if you try this because it's amazing. Yeah, do it. Do it right now. Have a great night, guys. See you later, folks. <laughs>